to log into Google Classroom for the first time, you have two options. The first option is to find the app switcher or the waffle, and when you select on it and scroll down, scroll down, scroll down, you're gonna be able to find Classroom underneath the app switcher or what some call the waffle. So I'm gonna to go to Classroom and it's gonna pop up here and you're gonna verify that this is the email address that you wanna use. You might be logged in with more than one email address, so do be sure that you are using your school email address and continue. Now this is super important. Choose teacher. I'm a teacher. This is not so easy to fix if you get it backwards. So please make sure you choose I'm a teacher. A teacher can both be a teacher and a student. So if you are on to participate in some professional development as a student. This is not going to stop you from that at all. Choose I'm a teacher. You get full privileges. I'm a student will be limited privileges. So I'm going to choose I'm a teacher. And right when you get in here, it invites you to create a class or join a class. Now I'm actually going to come up here to the upper right where you'll see this plus icon that says to create or join a class. So I'm going to click on the plus button and choose create class. And I always put the school year in this second line where it says section. I will tend to put it this way, so my period one algebra and the section, I wanna have the school year, trust me, this is gonna be an important piece of information later when you wanna reuse assignments from last year. And go ahead and click create. Now the other way to get to Google Classroom besides the waffle app switcher is to go to a new tab and just type in classroom.google.com. That's the word classroom, a period, Google, a period, and com. Push enter, and you'll see that brings me right into Google Classroom where I can see the class that I have already created. Now I can go ahead and make another class up here in the upper right. I'm gonna click the plus icon and choose create class, and I'll do algebra period two. Now what you're gonna notice is that's gonna, by default, give me the same color or banner header for each of these classes. It predicts, since I'm putting math, it puts a math background on there. So feel free, once you're in your class, to come up to the banner where it says customize, and you can choose a different color, so you have a different theme overall of your Google Classroom. So notice it is now purple, since I chose purple. Or I can change it to blue. And you can see my button here is now blue, but you might wanna distinguish it a little bit more. So I'm gonna choose select photo, and it's gonna allow me to choose from a lot of different backgrounds, something that you might like better. I'm gonna set the class theme. It's gonna to default to your theme color, but you can change that very easily by picking one of these colors and selecting save. Now to navigate, you're gonna look at these three lines menu in the upper left hand corner, and you're gonna come here to classes, and it's gonna bring you back to your class list, and you're simply gonna click on the class title to enter that class. And I can use that three lines menu to go back to the classes or the home page, or I can find the classes that I'm teaching right here in the sidebar.